Meteorologists aren't exactly sure where the myth came from, but it's absolutely not true. Although snow has become rarer in Charlotte, it has nothing to do with temperatures that are too low. It can never be too cold to snow. Come on guys, remember it snows in Antarctica. When moist air rises and cools, water vapor clings to floating particles of dust and pollen. If it's cold enough, the water freezes into these complex crystals we call snow. But moisture is actually a more important factor in the development of snow than temperature. This is why certain locations, like near the Great Lakes, experience lake effect snow. The lake infuses moisture into the atmosphere, which feeds the process. While it can't be too cold to snow, we often won't see heavy snowfall when it's below 15 degrees, and there's even less snow below zero. The frigid air is just too dry to produce larger flakes to make it down to the ground. As the air gets colder and colder, snow crystals form, but they don't develop into the fluffy large flakes we might like due to the lack of water in the atmosphere. Similar to Virga during warmer times of the year, the precipitation will evaporate after leaving the bottom of the cloud. The only temperature at which snow is in true impossibility is absolute zero, which is the lowest theoretical temperature in the world and the point in which no more heat can be removed. But remember, absolute zero is a theoretical temperature and something humans have never experienced. Absolute zero is colder than we can even comprehend. In Fahrenheit, it's 460 degrees below zero. For WCNC Charlotte, I'm meteorologist Brittany Van Voorhees.